What's up everybody? It's your girl Miss Mo. Welcome back to my channel. As you can see, I am up underneath the dryer. Today is Saturday, December 26th. Hey, good morning or good afternoon or good evening. Today, you know, dose, dose, day, dose. Photo bomb! day after Christmas had to make a pit stop if you want to see what else is going on with me today please keep on watching so I am here in the salon today with my peeps had to make a pit stop today is uh, my regular every two week standing appointment so yeah I came two weeks before Christmas and my next appointment luckily falls off on the day right after Christmas. I hope everyone had a very Merry Christmas. I did not um, vlog for that day on Christmas. I just wanted to enjoy the moment, enjoy the day, spend time with my family. No, I did not post, I did not vlog, I did not do anything on that day. So, yeah, that's, that's what happened on that day. I just enjoyed with my family. I spent time with my family and my boyfriend. And I ate, I opened up my gifts, watched my kids, we opened up their gifts and my mom, my grandson. We had a ball spending time with one another. Uh, of course, you know, it's Christmas time. Miss Janet is always thinking about her clients. She gave a little, little, <laughs> and it's always a thought that counts. She always thinks about us every single year. And I really, really appreciate her for that. She does a fantastic job on my hair, taking care of my hair and everybody else's hair that she does. And I know stylists in general sometimes have a hard time with keeping up with their own hair. You know, they have to depend on each other. And so when you're a stylist and you're working on however many people day in, day out, it's like, your hair is the last person's hair that you want to have to worry about. But that's okay because Miss Janet and the other stylists that work up in here, they always find time and they always find a way. I don't care what's going on. None of them have ever, ever, ever been looking like a hot mess. None of them. That's, that's some back in the day stuff that I, yeah, that used to happen to other stylists that I know, not mine. But yeah, you know how some stylists, they just be looking raggedy. They are just reckless and just don't be caring. Be having just, I can't even go into it. They just be looking raggedy. But yeah, I've never had that um, issue with Miss Janet. Miss Janet has always taken care of herself. Uh, you know, she cares about her appearance and all the other ladies that work up in here too. So shout out to the Glam Squad here at Simply Divine Beauty Lounge located on Island Farm Road in Springfield, Massachusetts. The link will be in the description box below. <laughs> just saying. Hey guys, so I just wanted to show you one of my uh, Christmas gifts. This is, um, my, my sister sent me this. Uh, from uh, California, my little little bag, little purse. Of course, this has I've always had these things, you know, little accessories. But yeah, this is my little bag. I like a medium-sized purse, you know. Uh, that's my preference. Yeah, medium-sized purse for me. Small purse if I'm like going out or something like that, or. If um, I you know, want to make a fashion statement with my outfit or whatever, you know, but medium size is my everyday go-to because I need to have certain things and I need to have room, you know, but no large, large oversized bags, that's not me. But yeah, I, um, like I said, I had a lot of fun on Christmas, you know, got some nice things, but it's not about the things, it's about the reason for the season, why we are all here why you know why it is the season what the season is about 
Yeah. Hope everybody's gonna, you know, do something fun today. Today's Saturday. It's 726. I, as I leave here, I'm not gonna run to Walmart to pick up uh, one thing. And then, um, I'm debating whether I want to shoot out to Costco and see if they got some paper towels. But of course, when I go home, I'm going to be editing. i got to do that because I still have several shows that I need to post. Several videos. So, I'm going to be doing that definitely. But I, other than that, I need to not be doing anything. I need to do nothing. I need to master the art of doing such things. <laughs> nothing. <laughs> How many have a problem with trying not to do anything? Is it a is it a task? Is it an issue for you? Do you find yourself being anxious like, oh my god, I gotta do something. I just can't sit here, blah blah blah. You know what I mean? You just gotta be moving, gotta be doing something. Some I yeah. Sad to say, I think I have that problem when it comes to, I don't know, when it comes to certain things, like if I'm at home, certain things, if I haven't gotten a chance to do them, if I'm on vacation or something like that, or got the day off or something, it's like, yeah, I'll do this while I got a chance. But, you also got to remember, it is fine and okay not to do nothing. You know what I mean? R and R, rest and relaxation. You, you have to remember that. You have to take care of yourself. You know, I know. You know, I can't preach and talk to anybody because I have to remember to do the same thing. Because if you don't take care of yourself, you can't take care of nobody else. But yeah, I can't wait <laughs> to relax today and sit up under this dryer, which is not really hot. It's just relax. Hey everybody, so I'm on my way to Walmart. I am done in the salon. In the salon. I'm done. Got my tight curls. On my way to Walmart, pick up this one thing and go back to the house. Um, what did everybody uh, cook for? Uh, I was getting ready to say Thanksgiving. What did everybody cook for Christmas? Y'all know what I had. I had the lemon pepper chicken, the barbecue chicken, candy yams, the macaroni and cheese, and the broccoli with cheese. And for dessert, I had a buttermilk pie from Patty LaBelle, and I had a apple crumb pie. Had got a vanilla ice cream and strawberry shortcake with whipped cream. So that's what was on the menu for my household. Everybody comment below, what'd you guys uh, have for Christmas? Uh, so yeah, my uh, boyfriend, he made, mm, he made some seafood Alfredo, people. Of course, the Alfredo sauce. He, we had um, lobster meat, we had shrimp, some minced clams in there. Let me tell you. It was excelente, excelente, that's all I have to say. So, of course, I ate twice yesterday. <laughs> I ate twice, y'all. It was good. By the time I was done with my family, it was time for me to eat again, believe me. Because uh, I haven't been eating too right too tough lately. I haven't been doing too good with that. But yeah. But yep, yeah, by the time I made it out of my my house with my family, it was time for me to eat again. I ate, ate it all too. It was so good. <laughs> it was so good. Slather some butter in there. What are you saying right now? Yep. Yeah. Get ready to uh run up in this store. And yeah, that's it for the day. I ain't going no place else. No place else. I'm not even going to Costco. Like I said, I wanted to check out to see if they had paper towels. I'm not going nowhere. I'm gonna get this one thing and go back home. I'm tired. Forget the foolishness. So, did everybody get what they wanted for Christmas? <laughs> did you? Well, did you? I hope everybody got, you know, pretty much what they wanted. Little of this, little of that. 
Hope everybody got something, be it big or small. It's the thought that counts. And remember the reason for the season, most of all. But yeah, I got some pretty, I got some pretty nice things. You know, a few of my, uh, a couple of my co-workers gave me a couple of things, which I am very, very appreciative for. So yeah, hope everybody else got what they wanted. But I am uh, getting ready to uh, end this video. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. When you subscribe, hit the bell icon so you can get notified for every brand new video that I post. Don't forget, go check out my uh, other videos, Vlogmas. I was trying to do the daggone thing. That is it for today, the day after Christmas, December 26th. We are having a nice Saturday, nice relaxing Saturday. I will see you in my next video. And like I always say, let's talk.